source? Yeah, what source? It's an anonymous uh, Obama stooge. This is complete bullshit. <laughs> and by the way, it's illegal. Someone is feloniously leaking shit. <laughs> this was supposed to be a top secret meeting, and it somehow got leaked. Trump has lost control, by the way. He's got so many people near him. I was in the room. It didn't happen. Yeah, but that's not important to the media. According to McMaster, Secretary of State Rex Tillerson and senior White House official Dina Powell were also present during the meeting. But American reporters were barred with the only pictures provided by Russian state media. In paper statements, Tillerson doubled down on McMaster's denial and Powell said... <laughs> the story is false. Doesn't get much more clearer than that. But yet the, <laughs> the media is running with it. <laughs> Disclosing classified information is different for a president, and what President Trump is accused of doing is not illegal. For so what's the fucking story about? Anyone else, it would be. The problem here is, according to intelligence officials, is... Yeah, which officials, okay? Which ones? Which anonymous Obama stooges are you talking to? Mr. Trump may have revealed sensitive... May have? Oh, did he? ...information to the Russians, which could... Could put, did it? Lives at risk. <laughs> this is not a fucking story. Or this flailing far left media just is absolutely out of control. Now they're running with a story in the Washington Post by anonymous sources claiming Trump revealed secrets to Russia. I mean, it's it's totally bogus, anonymous, unfounded stuff. And we're beginning tonight with breaking news. Breaking tonight, news. The Washington Post <laughs> is reporting that President Trump revealed highly classified information <laughs> Bullshit. to the Russian foreign minister and the Russian ambassador to the United States when the men met at the White House last week. The paper says that current and former U.S. officials say that Mr. Trump... Anonymous officials, Obama stooges. ...clothes that were not already known publicly during the campaign you may recall the candidate here comes the political agenda here comes the agenda trump was critical of hillary clinton who the fbi said mishandled classified information on her private email server back in july mr trump yep yeah, so trump and hillary are equal regarding the trump administration today has been whether the president is recording private conversations at wait a second that's the question you ask how about what you were just talking about? Who the fuck was listening in on Trump and the Russians and the Oval Office? Who the fuck is spying on Trump? White House. 2017, welcome to CBS This Morning. President Trump is accused of revealing highly classified intel. This is all from a Washington Post story with anonymous sources. It didn't happen. People in the room said it didn't happen, but watch them run with it like it's real. To Russia's top diplomats, the White House scrambles to explain what happened in the scrambles to explain. One of the Washington Post reporters. <laughs> Eye opener is supposed to be just a nonpartisan snippet of various interesting videos, but look, they they they've hijacked the eye opener into being completely stop Trump. Today's eye opener, your world in not eight seconds. In your reporting, it says that. <laughs> Oh, there's a concern. Oh, my God. <laughs> but, but that doesn't matter to the press. <laughs> They're going to run with this story like it really happened. <laughs> this... This fucking attention-seeking douchebag narcissist, ex-CIA motherfucker, he's all over the place. I'm gonna punch him in the face. And don't play us for idiots. No White House can sustain these types of constant leaks. So, if you're in the White House and you're doing this, well, then you might want to get out of the way. And I've answered the question over and over again in the same way. Another story regarding the Trump administration has been whether the president is recording private Stop Trump. Stop Trump. Stop Trump. <laughs> oh, wow. Something not Trump. Okay. I bet they go back to Trump. I bet they go back to Trump. The Donald Trump presidency, a stunning report 
claimed <laughs> may have revealed highly classified information to Russia. The Russia? Washington Post broke the story. It's broke the story. It's not a story. It's completely bogus. Sources of list the president revealed intelligence about the <laughs> laptop computers. It's a fake story. So secret that even close American allies <laughs> went off script and began describing details of an Islamic State terrorist threat related to the use of laptop computers. How is that classified? It's been all over the news. We know about this. It's not even remotely classified. 